everyone, and welcome to News Extra. And my guest this morning is Zane Hopkins with Friends of the NRA. Thank you very much for joining us this morning, Zane. Thank you for having me. Uh, and uh, we have Zane back to talk a little bit about the annual banquet for yes, sir. Friends of the NRA, which is coming up. Uh, tell us a little bit about it. The annual banquet this year is coming up Saturday, January 26th at 5.30 p.m. at the Hampton Inn. Okay. And take, that's when the doors on Soul sure. Flower is. Dinner's at 7. Okay. Uh, what do we have on the uh, on the dinner plate for uh, people that are going to be taking part? This year we're going to have prime rib again with mm-hmm. all the all the fixings. Okay. Um, anything in addition to uh, the dinner? Is there any fundraising component to it uh, aside the, from that, or are we just uh, just the, having? The no, banquet? this is our main fundraiser for the year. Um, we'll have games, silent auction items, live auction items, raffles, giveaways got quite a few things going on there and quite a, quite a number of items that'll be going on there yep. uh, definitely throughout the course of the evening um now when it when it comes to um friends of the nra you know how significant is this fundraiser for your organization and 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 how are the how are the monies you know allocated with that because i know i know that you share generally share some of the fundraising monies with the national organization as, as right. opposed to just um, the local this is our main one for the year mm-hmm. um we half of our money goes to the national half of it stays in state Mm -hmm. um which this year we brought back right around twenty twenty five thousand dollars again to this end of the state for shooting clubs and 4-h clubs and Mm -hmm. everybody in general that applied for the grants okay um we'll get some more details uh on uh, what's going to be going on at the Hampton Inn for uh, the Friends of the NRA annual banquet, as well as some more details on uh, some of the things they do here locally when we come back from this break. And we're back on News Extra, and we're talking with Zane Hopkins with Friends of the NRA, talking about the annual banquet for the organization that's coming up um, on the 26th. 26th. Uh, at the Hampton Inn. Again, yes, uh, starting out, starting up at what time? with uh, 5.30 is when the doors open. Yeah, for the for the social uh, engagement portion of it. And then right. dinner is at, uh, seven. at 7 o'clock. Uh, there is a fundraising component, obviously, with this. Right. Um, you had mentioned a little earlier with uh, silent auctions and, and things like that. What kind of what kind of items are, are available through that just to give people an idea of what they can run into? On the silent auctions, um, businesses around the community are gracious enough to donate things for us, and mm-hmm. we put them on, and um, I know there's some handmade stuff this year. Um, and then we just – it's just basically a silent auction – um, we also do a bucket thing where you buy a ticket pack and you throw tickets in the buckets next to the item you'd like to try to win. And if your ticket's numb, drawn, you win. <laughs> <laughs> that definitely works. Uh, what do those tickets run generally as far as how much per ticket do they usually run? On the ticket packs? Yeah. Um, I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Putting you on the spot you, you a, get a You get a wad of tickets oh, for... Okay. And then you decide which ones you want different to different denominations sure. of money. And you decide which ones you want to right. potentially go after. Right. Now you said there's something um, concerning the tables specifically that's that's right. Also um, this year too. we're also doing table sponsors. Um, that gets you eight dinner tickets. Oh, that's nice. And a guaranteed gun. Okay. Um, we have two of those available this year. We have a thousand dollar table and a five hundred dollar or fifteen hundred dollar table. Excuse okay. me. Um, okay. Differences and is the gun that you of get course, with it. of course, of <laughs> course, and that makes perfect sense. And and of course, this is the biggest fundraiser uh, for Friends of the NRA. Of course, we we just fairly recently had the Wall of Guns. How did that go? We sold her out once and got another lonely gun a new home. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's good to hear. That's very good to hear. And and of course, uh, all of the money's raised for Friends of the NRA. Uh, end up going toward a number of programs. Of course, there is the right. split with the national, but uh, the money does come back here locally. And, and explain some of those things again that that are done here locally uh, with some of those funds. Um, locally, I know we helped uh, uh, several clubs uh, just in our very region do some range improvements. Um, we're helping another 4-H pistol club get kind of off the ground, get running, going. Mm-hmm. Um, with this year's with the monies um we've helped other 4-h clubs with shells and rock and more equipment this year and we just try to keep the kids and everybody that wants to shoot 
if they're in the group, we try to get them involved, educate them, keep them involved. And have, have the ability to do so. And have the ability mm-hmm. to go out and shoot and have the equipment that they need to shoot. So um, for the um, annual banquet coming up, how do people get tickets? Um, they can contact myself at uh, 308-631-9416 or Steve Mount at 308-631-1835. And Trevor Bott, if you know him, get a hold of him. I can't remember his phone number <laughs> off the top of my head. Got, we've got Zane working off of uh, memory. <laughs> no, no notes here in front of him here today. Um, and, of course, the event itself. Uh, give us the rundown again of what we're looking at. Uh, the Hampton Inn, January 26th mm-hmm. at 5.30 p.m. Uh, when the doors open, social hour, games, uh, 7 at seven o'clock is the dinner. You prime, can, rib. prime rib. You can get uh, tickets at the door, mm-hmm. or you can get them ahead of time with calling one of us. We'll be happy to sell you tickets. <laughs> Sounds good. Zane Berry, thank you very much for joining us uh, this morning on News Extra. Thank you.